Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. How are you doing today? I'm fine, relaxing the house. <laughs> Relax. Okay, that is good. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, Carlos, Daniela, Jose Andres, and Salvador. Thank you so much for being here on time. Okay. Um, let me share my screen. Welcome, Gilberto. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you so much for asking. Okay, okay good. Welcome on board. I'm sorry? Welcome on board. <laughs> yes, <laughs> welcome everyone. Uh, welcome, Daniela. Well, this is the class number 12, okay? Today is July uh, 19, 2023. Okay, uh, today we are going to review um, different application. It is a job application form. We're going to fill in a job application. And also we are going to have the conversation that we are missing from yesterday, right? Um, at the end of this lesson, you will be able to identify a specific information of the job application form, okay? Well, welcome every, everyone. Welcome Robert, Mauricio, Katy, Jose Andres, Daniela, Salvador, Wilbur, Lady Carlos and Gilberto. Okay, I hope the rest of your yeah. classmates join us. Okay, because we are just around 10 students. Okay. <clears throat> okay, William Roque. Okay, good. So we're going to start the, the lesson today with this activity. I have some questions for you to practice simple presence, okay? Because this unit, um, we have been working with simple present. So I have some questions using the simple present, okay? So uh, Gilberto, you will be the first one, okay? I'm going to spin uh, the wheel and you're going to answer the question that you okay basic questions okay okay mm -hmm. what nationality are you uh, my nationality is Nicaraguense really my nationality is Nicaraguense Okay. Are you from Nicaragua? I didn't know. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. And for how long have you been here in El Salvador? Since when? How many years do you have here? Uh, the house aquí in Salvador? Yes, for how long? How many years? Uh, you have in El Salvador? Tw 25 years. Wow. Okay, but you have family in your country, right? So you go there. Yes. Okay. Good. And Bert, you are more Salvadorian than Nicaraguans. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And your wife yeah. is from El Salvador or from Nicaragua too? Uh, no, it's Salvador. Salvadorian, okay. My son, 
my okay. son Salvador and Caraguens. Yeah, they are both. Okay. Good. Both nationality. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, very good. Thank you so much for your answer. Okay, Carlos. Are you married? Yes, you told us last time, <laughs> right? Yes, I am married. Teacher, okay. yes, of course. Okay, for how long have you been, or uh, how many years do you have with your wife? Uh, since uh, 15 years old. 15 years. 16 no, no. years old. Wow. 15. Oh, 15. 15. Okay. 15, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, that is good, very good. Okay, thank you. Okay, lady. Hmm. Oh, what are your favorite subjects at the university? Do you remember which were your favorite subjects? Me, teacher. Sure. No, like math. Oh. Okay, math. Mm -hmm. mm, language. Languages. Okay. Languages. Mm. Social studies. Oh, okay. Good. Thank you so much, lady. Okay, now Maria Leticia. <clears throat> Do you have uh, brothers or sisters, Maria Leticia? Yes. I have three sisters with me mm -hmm. and six brothers. Wow, six brothers? Six brothers. And, yes. and two sisters. Oh, in total, nine. Yes. Okay, wow. Teacher, ¿cómo le pregunto en qué posición está ella o, o en qué momento oh. nació? Oh, oh. Number eight. Number eight. Number eight. Part, part, o ¿cómo se dice parto? Ah, <laughs> uh, like oh. a birth. Born. Uh -huh. Born number eight. Soy, soy la número ocho, pero del parto siete. <laughs> <laughs> Porque hay gemelos, por eso somos nueve. Oh. Tengo hermanos gemelos. Ajá. Oh. Por eso wow. son, nueve, son ocho partos, nueve hijos. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Good. So you have, a, like, uh, so you have a, a brother Fear that, of, uh, that birth that was born in, in the same day that you, Maria Leticia. Mm. Usted es. La gemela? No, no, ellos no, no. son mayores que mí. Tienen oh, ya 51 años. Uh -huh. They are older than you. Oh, okay. okay. Yo soy la, la chiquita de las niñas. <laughs> okay. How old are you, Maria Leticia? ¿Cómo? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Uh, ¿Cómo soy o cómo estoy? Mm, how, how old are you? Age. What is your age? ¿Cuántos años tiene? Um, 43. 43. 43. 43. 43. Uh, okay. My, my, my mom have um, a 30. No, a 3. 83. Your mom, wow. your mom is, remember when you say your age, you always use the verb to be, okay? Okay. Ah, my okay. mom is. My mom, mom is. is oh. Eighty-three. Eighty-three. Ah, okay. Yeah. Eighty-three years old. Okay. Good. <clears throat> good. Okay. Now, Silvia Estela. Thank you so much, Maria. Okay, teacher. Where do you live? I live in I live in Nehapa. Nehapa. 
Okay. For how long have you been there? What? Oh, I don't know. For how Repeat many it? years? How many years do you have in how that place? Uh-huh. Ah. How many? Cuantos? Años do you have in that place? In the Japa? Ah. Ah, I have the uh, 11 year old. 11 years in the Hapa. Yes. Living in si. the Hapa. Si. Okay. Yes. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Okay. Now will be Jose Andres. Are you at the university, Jose Andres? No, I know I studied yet, teacher. Not yet. Okay. No yet. I just okay. work. <laughs> oh, okay. So in this case, I will change the, the question. How do you okay. get to the to the workplace? By bus or driving? Yeah. Sometimes driving, teacher, but most common in the bus. In the bus. By bus. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Maria. Oh, no. Leticia is. Okay. Already participated. Okay. Rolando Danilo. Teacher, excuse me. Yes, Carlos. What's mean? How do you get to the, to the university? What is the meaning? How do you get? Como, uh -huh. como, como llegas, llegar? como vas. Uh -huh. Ah. O sea. No, es decir, como tomar el bus o, 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 o cómo es la, la, el sentido. How do you get? It doesn't matter. I mean, it, it is asking how if you go by bicycle, if you go by bus or driving or walk, walking. So uh, it doesn't matter ah, how, okay. but it's asking how do you get, okay? Como llegas, como le haces para llegar. Mm, okay, okay. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. I am driving to go to the university, for example. Yes, I drive, for example, drive, drive to go to university. Yes. Okay, Rolando Danilo. Okay. Do you work, Rolando Danilo? Uh, I work in San Salvador, teacher. Okay, yes, I do. Uh -huh. I work yes, in San Salvador. Yes. Okay. Okay. Is this your first job or um, no? Have you been working no, in another place? Know. Uh, I don't know, teacher. Uh, my first work is in, oh, I'm uh, from in San Miguel. Oh, your, your first job was in San Miguel. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. Thank you so much. Okay, now, uh, William Roque, I don't know if you are available to participate. I guess no, because it says oyente, okay. Juliana, are you there? No? Okay, Wilbur Francisco? Okay, teacher. Okay. okay. Okay, what kind of movies do you like? How do you say a uh, drama? Drama. 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 Yeah. Drama. Um, yes. Okay, my my favorite movies of drama. Drama genre. Okay. Who has a, a plan to go to the cinema this coming week? to watch Barbie. <laughs> yeah. Who? The, the, pink, the pink baby. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, if you go, let me know. <laughs> okay, good. Um, let me see, Salvador Alberto. What are your hobbies, Salvador? 
Uh, my hobby is um, play guitar. Mm -hmm. Play the guitar, okay. I play video games. <laughs> ah, okay. I try to, to, to do exercise. Exercise, <laughs> okay. In my I mean in my time free free time <laughs> in your free time your free time okay very good that is good yeah it's really important right to exercise yes. okay okay Daniela Lisette okay. what is what are your favorite foods my favorite food is tacos. Okay, tacos. What else? Do you have another favorite uh, food? Mm, only. Tacos only. The pupusas. Pupusas. <laughs> really? Okay. I know, I know someone that is so, cheese. So cheese the tortilla is delicious, teacher. Oh, yes. yes. <laughs> it is. Yeah, I have someone. Well, it actually is. She's my co-worker. She's from El Salvador, but she said that she doesn't like the tortas. She doesn't like the tamales. Uh, she doesn't like, uh, I don't know. I don't remember what uh, the other kind of food, but all the typical food that we have, she doesn't like. Oh, really? Was, Why? I don't know. She said simple, mm -hmm. like, I don't like it. But, <laughs> it is, but what, kind, what kind of food is uh, there? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Carlos? Mm -hmm. what, what kind of food uh, uh, eats your co Her favorite food. Um, I don't know what is her favorite food, but she said that she doesn't like the typical food. <laughs> really? Ahí está, mi amor. Ahí está la roja, color rojo. Okay. Rojo. Oh, oh, only, only pan de caja integral. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> only <laughs> baseball. Yeah. I don't maybe. know. I don't know because we don't we don't share like the the lunch time together because we we work uh from home right so we used to have meetings. And she said that, but I, but I don't know what kind of food she she eats. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, good. Uh, Robert, you will be next. What do you study, Robert? Hey, teacher. Right now, I I am studying. I am studying English at uh, in support. I had class from 8 p.m. to 10 a.m. And I, yeah. I study from Monday to Friday, but mm -hmm. at Saturday I had class. I had class for 1 p.m. to 5. 5 p.m. at E4CC at Plaza Merliot. Oh, okay. English for call centers? Yeah. Right. Uh, right now, right now, I have to, to go out for study English first, first, because I will travel to USA and second, because I I will get it a better job, for example, at call center and other company. This is my goal for study English. Oh, okay. Yeah. Do you have visa, Robertillo? Uh, yes. Uh, right now, my I have family in the USA, and I have documents in Embassy American. Really? Oh, nice. Oh, they, your relatives are doing the process for you yes. to get this uh, citizen? American yes. citizen? Oh. Yes, I, 
I I I hope for 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 document for citizen or already resident resident residents uh -huh. resident wow. yeah because my family live live in the United States my father live in the United States and my siblings oh wow congrats so soon you will be uh there working okay doing a lot of money remember yeah, yeah remember your team okay remember your your insa for team and your teacher too yeah, right yes there. i love it <laughs> <laughs> i will i will give you my bank account okay <laughs> okay okay uh, yeah. give me give me your account for whatsapp <laughs> Okay, Send me the the a a a, a number <laughs> or a digits. <laughs> ah, okay, just yeah. kidding. Okay, but yeah, yeah that is good American news. Dream. Yeah, good news. Very good. <laughs> you will have a lot of opportunities there. Yes. Okay. Uh Kathy Briseida, are you there? Kathy? No? Okay, Cindy, Janet. Hi, teacher. Hi. Okay. Uh, I have this question for you. Okay. Do you enjoy studying English? Why? If you said yes. And why if you said no? Uh, yes, teacher. I, I like to because learn new things mm -hmm. okay what else mm -hmm. uh, i would like to hear my my daughter you like to yeah, uh, to help, uh, help, uh -huh. help. I would like daughter. to help my daughter. Okay. okay. With her homework. Okay, good. That's all, teacher. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, Mauricio, are you there, Mauricio? Uh, yes, sister, I'm here. Okay. Mm, no, this one no. Okay, let me do it. Another one. I guess you already know how to spell. Okay. What do you do in your free time, Mauricio? Uh, well, in my free time, teacher, um, sometimes I go to running mm -hmm. and. Mm -hmm. At the night, I go to swim in pool. Okay. Because I live in, in San Miguel and here the the weather is so hot. Oh, okay. Uh, yes, I know. Yeah. And that's my... my uh, that is that's, what you do in your, yeah. free, in your free time. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay. Um, Silvia Stella, are you there? Yes, it is. Silvia, try to. Yes, it is. Sí. Uh, creo que tiene dos devices, dos, dos equipos conectados. Cuando, yes. cuando uh -huh. está usando uno, tenga el otro en mute. Porque si no tiene un, un eco feo para nuestros oídos, ¿ok? Yeah, ah, ok. Feel bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, ¿Cómo se llama? Feel bad. I don't know. <laughs> ok. Um, ok. Let me ask you this question. Do you think that English will be useful for you in the future? Uh, do you yes teacher yes i i think the english uh, the my future 
will be useful. Right? Useful. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, what else? I mean, why? The reason. The reason. Tell, me, tell us the reason why you consider that. The reason? Mm -hmm. I don't understand. The reasons why will be useful for you in the future. What will be uh -huh. the advantages that you are going to have? No, teacher, I don't understand. But I, I, I'm, bueno, entiendo que la pregunta está diciéndome sobre un futuro hablando en inglés, ¿verdad? Yes. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo me veo? ¿Eso entiendo o estoy mal? Do you think that English will be useful? Si le será muy útil para usted el futuro. Ah. Okay. Yes, And yes. I, mm -hmm. Yes, I think that English, uh, because my, it is important uh, the idiom, quiero sería, speak English, uh, the, my future work, uh, but my eh, eh, lo uso uso en algunos eh, catálogos no sé cómo decirle catalogs ajá uh -huh. y my customer service oh the information is in English yes oh okay good teacher yes how long did you learn English how long or did since you learn English for I mean how how long I study English that is that is what you want to ask uh, ¿en ¿cuánto cuánto tiempo tiempo? Aprendió English? how long did you learn or mm. how long have you been learning English well I started when I was 20 20 years old um mm -hmm. and it is a long process i consider really? that i consider that yes i am still learning <laughs> okay because um there are some words that that we learn uh, i mean no, maybe not every day but uh we learn new words okay because we don't know everything right so there are a lot of like a technical words that we don't know. So we still uh, learn. Uh, but I started the university in 2006. Mm -hmm. How old are you, teacher? <laughs> Esto no se dice. <laughs> no, okay, no, that no inform problem, teacher. No that problem. information is not provided. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, good, no problem. <laughs> Thank okay, you. <laughs> no problem. No, okay. I'm I'm 30, 36 years old. Uh, really, maybe uh, you can, uh, you has study maybe 16 years, more or less. Mm -hmm. For 16 years. Well, at the university, you know, five years, right? Uh, then with the thesis process, it's another extra year that is, um, we study six, six years. But then um, you always are in contact with the language because you use it, right, in your jobs. So you are still learning. So you never stop learning. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Uh, I think that uh, maybe I, I think now I feel really good because uh only have one year to learn English so maybe one year I'm missing yes uh, maybe missing like 15 years more or less <laughs> you are good I mean if you have just one year you are good because um I consider that today we have more tools like a digital tools that make yes. the learning process easier than before. Because I remember in 2000, in 2006, 
when I started, I didn't have a, a smartphone. I didn't have access to internet in my house. Only books. Only books. Yeah, physical dictionaries. Only dictionary. Uh -huh. Yes, today maybe it's more easy to learn it. It is. It is easier. Because, yes. yes. It is easier because, I mean, you have a smartphone, uh, you have internet, and everything is more ac accessible, accessible, right? So yes. you, we have a lot of um, information in the social media. Um, it's easier nowadays. So if you start to learn a language, I consider that if you study a lot during the days, at least two or three hours per day, I consider that, yes, in one year and a half, so you have a good level. Okay, teacher. Teacher. Yes? How many, how many years did you work in a call center? How many years? Um, yeah. Since 2014. Okay, I, I, I asked you because uh, I would like work in a call center in size or telos or, or other. I, I would like to work in a call center. Okay. Um, what, do, what do you remember about, about preparing for a call center? What I remember about, um, okay, what you need to do is be ready for the interview, okay? Because okay. they want to see you, right? That you are able to have a conversation with someone. Also, you will do a test, like a grammar test, a typing test, if you are really fast to type in a computer. Uh, for example, searching information in Google. So you also, oh, okay. you're, for example, they will ask you, what is located? Uh, okay. I don't know. They will give you a name of, of a place or, or famous. Well, what is uh, El Coco Beach? Aha. Uh -huh. And an, an example, right? So in the end, you have to answer where. But you, you will go to Google. You have that option to Google it. And then you will answer. But they they will give you like, a, for example, 10 minutes to answer 10 questions. One, one, one question per minute. One question per minute. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, okay grammar, yes. And also reading. Reading comprehension. That is important. So... They will give you like a reading by a paragraph or an essay and then questions, okay, that you need to answer related to the, okay. to this, to the reading. Yes. Teacher, uh, what has been your best call setting experience? Uh, tell us is really good. Okay. Um, yeah. And also Cognizant. I have been working also in Cognizant. They are, uh, they weekends are off. Weekends off. Yes, that is really good. And now uh, I am still... Oh, yes. They had a good hiding bonus in December, right? <laughs> if you go. Okay. Yeah. And it's still working in a call center. I, I remember that I told you. But it's a very good uh, account. Because um, we don't have like a, a lot of calls, okay? Sometimes I receive just one call per day and one okay, email. That is, that is one that I never, um, it is the only one maybe in El Salvador. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm lucky I, I have, yes? I have a question, teacher. I don't know if the reality is like the people say, uh, talk, it's like uh, when you work in a call center, you don't have time for anything. For example, if you want to go to the restaurant, you just have mm, 10 minutes. If you want to take your bread, your lunch, or just your breakfast, 
you don't have enough time. I don't know that if the people talk is the reality or just uh, is a, a lie. It's a reality in some places, some accounts, okay? It depends on the clients. It depends on the account. There are different accounts, for example, one that you can work with bank, okay? It is related to money. Yes. Also related to health. Uh, you can work in, um, in uh, insurance, okay? Insurance for cars, for houses, or for health. Uh, they they are really good because they are just from Monday to Friday, right? Also, you can work for hotels, uh, stores, right? Uh, transportation. Okay, there are different accounts. So it depends on the account. So if they are really back to back as someone's, I don't know if you have heard that phrase, back to back is, it means that uh, you receive a lot of calls. You hang up one call with a, a customer, then you receive another one. Maybe you can receive more than 50 calls during the date. So they, Teacher, that accounts are really difficult. Yes? Uh, I think so. Uh, yeah, really situation, the situation, it depends on the company. Uh, where do you work? Uh, mm -hmm. Because uh, there are different companies. Uh, <clears throat> In the time is short. For that reason, depend on the company where do you work. And okay. I had a, a friend. He he works outside, and he worked forty hours a week. And he he start work at six a.m. to to three p.m. And mm -hmm. he come back to home at four. He stay at at it's home. Cool. And after that, she he receiving receiving class of university is very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it depends on the account. As I said, it depends on the line yes. of business that you are. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, that is a good topic to speak about. Okay, how to work in a call center or the experiences in a call center so that you 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 will have if that is your dream if that is your goal soon you will be working in a, in in one of these places okay julio we're going to continue because of the time okay but if you have questions you can let me know julio pass uh you will be the last one i get i remember i didn't ask you before right are you there Julio? Uh, yeah. Thank okay. You. Okay. Tell the class about your family. Any information that you want to share about your family? Okay. Um, in my family, and we are uh, four people mm -hmm. my wife and um, two daughters. Okay. Uh, my wife uh, works with my sibling, cuñado. Mm -hmm. Your, uh, your brother-in-law. Okay. Uh, my, bro my wife works with my brother-in-law. Uh, my daughter, uh, my two daughters, uh, the first is Emily. Uh, she studied at but say uh, naval base uh -huh. in the um, second daughter the more uh, the little daughter uh, she studied at uh, five grade in canton conchawita um my daughters uh, like to play soccer and uh, they play soccer uh, they uh, have much with the uh, um, Liga Atletica Policial. Uh, today, uh, Emily um, mm. has a match uh, with his team, her team, uh, versus uh, Sultan. Um, I love 
so much to my family. Um, it's important to share with the family. Um, no sé qué más. Okay. I believe it is, I believe it is the most important to share, uh, to communicate, uh, to go out uh, juntos. Yes, together. Together. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Thank you so Thank much. You. Yes, it's really important to have to spend time with you with the family, right? Because are the only ones that we will that will be with you. Well, I consider that that um I don't know, for, maybe for some people it's not like that, but for uh, the majority of the population, so family is always there, right? Um, that is why it's really important to, to spend time with your family, quality time, right? And get along with everybody in your family. Okay, good. So because of the time, we're going to stop here. We have more questions, but we're going to stop here and we're going to continue with um, the activities. Someone has Teacher. questions? Yes. Excuse me, teacher. The, the last question for you. No Sorry? problem. The, the last question. Uh for you. Uh-huh. What advice would you give us to avoid disappointment? For um for example. Disappointment. Do you mean disappointment? When, um maybe when I when I study English, uh, suddenly I uh, I feel maybe, uh, maybe I says, uh, I, I don't, I don't want I, to I don't feel, yes, I don't want to continue. I, I feel so maybe a little bit disappointment. Uh, disappointment. What advice would you give us to, to maybe avoid these thoughts? Okay, disappointed. That is the, the correct um, uh, adjective to describe. Disappointed. That. That feeling, okay? Disappointed. Disappointed. Yes. Okay. Um, Disappointed. My, my advice for you is to have a clear goal, okay? What do you want? What is the okay. main purpose? So, for example, if you said, oh, okay, um, if I get graduated, I will get this diploma, okay? I will get a better job. If if your salary now is, I don't know, $500. Example, right? $500. Okay. But if I, if I work in a call center, it will be $800. So you will have X, $300 extra, right? Okay. So you can say, okay, I will save that $300 to buy a house, right? That will be your dream. That will be your goal. That will be um, the purpose that you have. Okay. I consider that every everything um, works if you have a goal. Because if you don't have any goal, mm, if you don't love what you are doing, so probably... Disappointment. Yeah. You will get dis disappoint disappointed. <laughs> and then you will say, oh, no, I don't want to continue. It will be better to, to, to sleep or, I don't know, do something else. Watch like, TV, maybe. Yeah. Watch the, the novella. Uh-huh, the soap opera. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, that, is, that is my advice. If you have a clear goal in your life, so you will be able to reach what you what you want, okay? It doesn't matter if it takes time because it will take time, right? It is no tomorrow you will you will um um make it reality. So you need to be aware about that. Tiene que ser conscientes que necesita llevar tiempo, okay? Lleva mucho okay. tiempo 
dedication, okay? Dedicación, effort, esfuerzos, okay? Desvelos, everything. Mm -hmm, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Uh, your body is clear to me, teacher. Thank you. <laughs> okay, good. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good, guys. So, I, the activity that we have pending from yesterday is, do you remember? It is a conversation between, uh -huh, it's a two, Joe interview, maybe. Two HR agents, dos, digamos, dos employees from HR, and three applicants, applicantes or candidates. Okay, so do you remember that we said that we, that we are going to select one of the positions that you can apply uh, in, a, in the company in human resources? Who remember what are the positions? If you did, if you change that, it's okay because at this time we cannot, we cannot change because we don't have time. But um, the the positions that you sh that that I told you are the ones that are in human resources. Do you remember the positions? <clears throat> okay. For example, this one, right? Recru recruiting, recruitment coordinator, coordinator mm -hmm. benefits, benefits specialist, talent management consultant, mm -hmm. human resource generalist. Yes, all of them, right? You cannot, you can do it with one of the the positions that you have there. Okay, good. I remember we have four teams. Okay, let me use the wills of names in order we can do it yes. Okay, um, here we have then from room one, we have Carlos, Cindy, Daniela, Gilberto, and Hazel. Room two, Jose, Julio, Katy, Lady, Liliana. Room three, Maria, Mauricio, Robert, Rolando, and Salvador. And room four, we have Silvia and Wilbur. Ready? Okay, let me see yes, who, who will be the first one. Okay, T3. What is uh, Maria Leticia, Mauricio, Robert, Rolando, and Salvador? When you are ready. Okay, good evening. Good evening. Maria Leticia, are you ready? Yes. Salvador? Yes. Mauricio? Yes, ready. Rolando? I'm ready. Excellent. Okay, uh, we we'll we start, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Okay, good morning. Thanks for coming. My name is Roberto Carlos Salvarenga. I am the manager of the company. The name of the company is Naviera SA, uh -huh. and we are hiring staff for this company. Uh, mm -hmm. I have three questions for you. Number one, tell me about yourself, Maria Leticia. Okay, good morning. Mr. Roberto, my name is Maria Leticia. I am 43 years old. About me, I can say that I like to work 
as a team and I would like to be part of the company. Okay, next. Salvador. Uh, hello, uh, Mr. Robert. Uh, mm -hmm. In my experience, I I working in operation and logistic import. I I coordinate the the import and export cargo in import Acajutla, import uh, Puerto Barrio, Santo Tomás, también. Um, I I think uh, I I como se dice. I am prepared to apply this position. Okay. Uh, I am prepared and in, in all position in the logistic and any operation and work. Right. Mr. Mauricio, tell me about yourself. Okay. Hello, Mr. Robert. Uh, my name is Mauricio. And I'm glad to meet you. I'm here because I want to work for his uh, uh, for his corporation. And I um, I have uh, I have my study in accounting and I have uh, five years of experience and I will I would like to work for your company. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Mauricio. Mr. Rolando. Thank you. Tell me uh, about yourself. Good night, Mr. Robert. I am Danilo. I am 36 years old. I live in Suchitoto. I experience in my in my work from 20 years. I graduated at the ICA. My profession is technical electric. I can work in a think only. Excellent guy. Thank you for your answer. I had a question number two. Tell me, why do you want to work at this company? I repeat, I repeat the question. Number two, tell me, why do you want to work at this company? Maria Leticia. Okay, I find it an important and interesting company. I know how much they value their employees and the money benefits and benefits they give to their employees only. Thanks, Mr. Roland, Roland Salvador. Uh, yes, in my case, uh, I want to to uh, Put in practice uh, my my notes <laughs> and and I I want to learn more to to the operation and logistic in the company to use for attend a client and shippers and all in the company for help and grow up the company. Thank you, Mr. Mr. Rolando. Tell me, why do you want to work at this company? Uh, in my case, I think so about the company. In I work the company, for example, the company is a famous, the company is a, a famous people 
uh, the company is a responsible, uh, the company make a thing, uh, appointment only. Excellent. Thanks for your, for your answer. I have the last question. Number three, can you tell me what tool do you use at work? Maria Leticia. Um, the tools I use are computer, calculator, meter, photocopier, printer, and printer. An additional, more, more basic English course. <laughs> 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 Only. Okay, Salvador. In my case, to work, uh, I I know to use a computer calculator. Um, in the computer, I I know to use the Office program to to management uh, the control uh, what company need to control the productions and movements status of cargo uh, schedules to 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 vessels and report any what company needs. Thanks. Mr. Mauricio, can you tell me what tool do you use at work? Okay. Okay, Mr. Robert. I can use uh, the computer and I can drive uh, some equipments, equipments like uh, for cliff and drive uh, heavy trucks. And, uh, and others. Thank you. Thank you. Mr. Rolando. Okay, Robert. I can use a different machine. I can use a computer. I can, I can drive a car. I can drive a motorcycle. And I read the report and use the calculator and other tools. Okay. Thanks everyone for, for coming for the interview. I am going to call you as soon. And I have a nice day. Bye bye. Okay, okay bye bye. Thank you, Thank you, Mr. Robert. Thank you, Mr. Thank you. Okay, guys. Very good job. Very good job. I will call you soon. I will call you as soon as possible. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that are the 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 typical phrase that we receive. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, but believe me, when, when you apply in a call center, they will let you know the same day, okay? So you are hired, you are here, okay? Welcome. le vamos a llamar, le dicen a uno. Oh, no, oh, no, but the, if, if, if they consider that you don't qualify for the, uh, for the um, position, they told you. So in this case, you need to study another three months and you can you can apply again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Maria Leticia was very good. Photocopier. Okay, that is a correct. Photocopier. Um, Photocopier. 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 Okay. Photocopier. That is okay. a machine that makes copies. Okay. Okay. Photocopier. Or copy. Okay. Every, everything, everything was good. Okay, Salvador. So you said knowledge. 
right? I would like to improve my knowledge. I remember, okay, try to, to repeat that, knowledge, okay? Knowledge. Mm -hmm. And try to, <laughs> try to think in English when you are speaking in English, okay? Avoid Spanish word. Um, okay, Mauricio, equipment. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes. Great. Okay. okay. Tools. Okay. Tools. 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 Yes. Okay. Tools. Or you can say also devices. For example, devices. the computer is a device. Uh, the tablet is a device. Uh, like uh, electronic devices. Everything that is electronic also can be a device. Okay. Okay, Rolando was good. Okay, an advice, guys. That but that is for a re, uh, real interview. When you have an interview, try to search about the company. Okay, try to search information like the values, the mission, and the benefits that they provide. If someone works in that company, ask that person like uh, the experience, right? So that is important to mention in, in the interview when someone asks you, why do you want to work in this company, right? So you can mention the benefits that they have and why you consider that it, that will be a good company to work in. Okay? Okay, teacher. Mm -hmm. And Robert, you said what kind of tools do you do you use at work or uh, you can also ask um tell me what kind of devices or what kind of uh it depends also the position that i apply in right also you can okay. specify the kind of devices if they can use them what kind of devices mm -hmm. devices Yes. What kind of devices? What kind of devices do you know? Do you use at work, or or do you have experience working with? Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. That was really good. Good job. Let me see who will be the next team. Okay, team number four. In team number four, we have Sylvia and Wilbur. Are you here? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. When you are ready. Okay. Well, one moment. One moment. Okay. Mm -hmm. Will be. Hi, Will be. Will be says that he that is he is ready. Hello, hello, Sylvia. Hello. How are you? How are you? I I'm fine, very great. Okay. Uh, what? How? Uh, uh, where do you live, uh, Sylvia? I live in Hapa. Mm. In this moment, do you work? Yes, I work in Taller Small Truck. Okay. What is your position in, 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 in this company? My job leader is Tenny. Tenny. Ah, perdón, perdón. Repeat, please. Uh, what is your position in your company? Ah, in my company, my position is the. 
the customer server. Uh, why, for, for what do you change the work? Change, uh, yes. Uh, mm, for what? For what? For what? What do you want? Do you want change another word? Ah, change. Yes, my change is the uh, 20, uh, 20. No, es, eh, la pregunta seven. es por, eh, Silvia, ¿por uh -huh. qué quiere, por qué quiere cambiar de trabajo? Ah, perdón, <laughs> la confundí. Okay. Ahorita, ahorita. Vaya, sería la respuesta. In this moment, eh, I am uh, in this moment, it's important eh, the new eh, working, but the, eh, but the job little eh, is the technical, technical Técnica Ingenier Mechanic. Y es necesario the new, eh, em, em, the new work, but the, but the eh, practice, practice eh, my job little. Ah, ok. Eh, what is your work location in this moment? In this moment, eh, taller small truck, eh, lo que, um, taller small truck is location in the 49th Avenue North, San Salvador. San Salvador. Okay. And what, what is your essential duties and, respons and responsibilities? In, my, in es ah, my essential beauty in the responsibility is a search new customer. Uh, I give training. Uh, I am check report. Uh, I am a customer. Uh, se me, se me ido ahorita esta palabra. Uh, bueno, solamente. Mm, okay. Uh, okay, Silvia, we we call 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 it in another opportunity. Call it in the okay. new uh -huh. Le, le llamaremos. Thank you. <laughs> That's it, teacher. Okay. Thank you so much, guys. Okay, Silvia, uh, duties, okay? So when he asks you what are your duties and responsibilities, so you can also Duty. answer, uh -huh. yeah, my duties and responsibilities are, and you start saying what you do, right? Mm -hmm. and, when, and when you see I, I am check reports, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. in this case, you only can say I check report, okay? Because it is a, like, it is a task that you do in your company, right? And I guess you wanted to say customer service, right? Well, you said customer, but you didn't remember the other word that was customer service? And the, the search new customer. Oh, search new customers or call new customers. Yes. No, S search new customers. Oh, okay. It is my duty. Okay, one of your duty duties. Okay. Mm -hmm. You say also uh, for this moment is important and you're working. Okay. Mm -hmm. But you uh, need to paraphrase that idea saying like uh, at this moment, for me, it is really important a new job, okay? Because I want to change. I want to change my my uh, 
my uh, workplace or my position uh, because I want to have better opportunities. I want to get a better salary and more reasons, mm -hmm. right? That, that can uh, support what you are saying. Okay. Okay, Wilbur, also, uh, remember when you ask someone why they want to quit the job, the actual job and apply for a new position, you can ask, uh, why do you want to change your job, okay? Why do you want to apply to, to this position? Or why do you want to quit to your current job and apply for this new position? Uh, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. okay, where is your workplace located? Okay, where, where is, where is, is uh -huh. located, okay? Mm -hmm. And at the end, we are going to call you. You can say, we are, okay, that, that is my interview. We are going to call you later. Okay. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay, good. Thanks, thank you so much. Okay, thank you so much, guys, for your participation. So let me um, see who is next. <clears throat> Okay. T1. What is Carlos, Cindy, Daniela, Gilberto, and Hazel? Okay. Okay, teacher. Good evening. Uh, Hazel is not here, teacher. Hazel. Uh, oh, no problem. Write the message of the, the, pro, uh, the WhatsApp. Okay, it's no problem. Right. Let me okay. see. It's okay. Okay, um, let's see. Cindy, I think is my thing with Gilberto. And maybe uh, there is a, a, another, another coworker. Mm. Or, or another candidate. Okay, so maybe you will be... You will be the interviewer, right, Carlos? Yes, of course. And who else? Okay. Cindy, si quiere, pregúnteme usted primero. Okay. Then we have a Cindy, Daniela, and Gilberto, right? Okay. Cindy, Daniela, are you ready? Gilberto? Yes, ready. Okay. Yes. Good. Okay. Good morning. Welcome to Multiplaza Company. Uh, Gilberto, Cindy, Daniela, welcome. Good morning. I'm Carlos, um, nice to meet you. Uh, Good welcome. morning, Don Pedro. Okay. Uh, thank you for time. Uh, okay. My name is Gilberto Benito Santa Maria Rio. Okay, uh, great. Thanks for, for staying here. I hope. We didn't keep you waiting for, for long. And um, I have a, a couple questions for you for the, the applying for the job. Okay. Yes. Um, first question is about, let's see, um, Hilberto, tell me about yourself, Hilberto. Can you repeat? Tell me, tell me about yourself. Oh yeah, my name is Gilbert Gilberto Santa Maria. Okay. Uh, I work in Salesman. My experience twenty year in Salesman. Oh. My experience import the product the Nicaragua has how cacao, maní, ajonjolí, and other oh. products. Okay, uh, Cindy, uh, how about you? Tell me, uh, tell me about yourself. Hello, my name is Cindy Quintanilla. 
uh, my experience in my work is is um, is cashier. Okay. I have um three years old in in my company. That's okay. Cool. Okay, uh, Daniela. Please uh, tell me about yourself. Yeah. My name is Daniela. I am a very happy person, but with reserve, I do not like place where many people are. I consider myself a fairly empathetic person. I am 21 years old. I live with my mother and my two sisters. I am quick, dedicated to my work, and, and I do not like people evading my space. Okay. Um, okay, good. Um, Cindy, uh, what do you want to work here? Hello, Cindy. Hello. Uh, what do you What do you want to work here? In my case. In my case, I would like to work in, in here because Hello. Hola, hola. Me escuchan? Yes, yes, go ahead. Okay. Because I like it. Because I like your location. In, okay. In my case. Okay. Uh, how about you, uh, Gilberto? Uh, what is your greatest strength? Uh, in my case, uh, they solicitors employ in, in the other company. Uh, for uh. Um, um, war stay in the company. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, I, I want to tell you that we have three plays for uh, recruiting coordinator, benefit specialists, uh, administrative administrative assistant. Com Pensation especially. Uh, who have uh, some skill about this position? The position, the, the employee uh, better salary, mayor bonification, Okay, but but the, the, the question is uh, if um, you have skill about the, this position, uh, do you have speeding about the um, recruiting coordinator uh, in human research and um, in payroll maybe and maybe yeah. in, in, in department administration? No, a manager salesman 
for his parents in, in Salesman. Okay. 20 years. Um, the, uh, the work, the people were. Uh, okay. Okay, how, how did you hear about this position? Eh, eh, ¿Cómo yeah. se enteró de esta plaza? How, how did oh. you hear about this position? Uh, oh, uh, in, the, in, in my case, like it in, in uh, uh, information, the, the position, the work in, in the company, in your company. Okay. Uh, Daniel, how about you? Um, how did you hear about this position? ¿Qué posición quiero? No, no. ¿Cómo se enteró de la, de la plaza? Um... <laughs> For... For Facebook. <laughs> okay. And do you have some skill about payroll, human resource, um, uh, uh, clear about administration? Mm. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I really uh, uh, hope to... Uh, the manager of the of the area uh, really I want to uh, or, or I have to three place for uh, position related to human resource and really appreciate to be stay here and I will call you later for a new interview okay 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 thank you for your time here. Bye, take care. Bye. <clears throat> okay, that's it. Okay. No los quiero regañar. <laughs> <laughs> no okay, los quiero teacher. regañar, okay. But I give you time to be prepared, okay? Carlos, very good job, okay? But uh, yes, the... The other, uh, well, the team, the rest of the team. So if you have, if you have time to get prepared for an interview, right? It doesn't matter if it is just a conversation in the class, but you need to prepare your ideas, okay? Written ideas. Ustedes las pueden escribir en su cuaderno. <clears throat> if you can see that it's difficult for you to express yourself, okay? Speak uh try to write your ideas okay and then just read your ideas uh you you could do it better okay lo pusieron lo pudieron haber hecho mejor yes it's yo yes. tenía yo suponía que Cindy me iba a preguntar y tenía las dos preguntas de ella pero no me preguntó ella <laughs> Mm -hmm. Fue como quemar ropa, como una entrevista de verdad. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. Me emocioné. Ayer, ayer hubieran escogido al de recursos humanos. <laughs> Se salió. Okay. Se salió del grupo. Ok. Well, <clears throat> ok. So, you can. Maybe stay, as I said before, it doesn't matter, okay? <clears throat> Aquí no pasa nada. But if you are trying to, to improve, okay, your skills, okay? Speaking, writing, and how to develop your, your speaking skills or how to speak in front of others. Yes, you need to practice, okay? You need to practice a lot. Okay. <clears throat> Just Gilberto. So you, you were speaking about the products that you sell, you said, right? One of them you said yeah, that cool. is alhonjolin, right? Sesame. That is? Yeah. Sesame. 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 Mm -hmm. Alhonjolin is sesame. Yes. 
Ah, ok. Assumi. Ok, that will be in English. And also you say money, right? How do yeah. you say How do you say money in English? Mm -hmm. uh, Peanuts. Peanut. It's like a ah uh, at the end. Peanut. 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 Okay. Peanut. Peanut. Mm -hmm. And also you say what else you said? Cocoa? Chocolate. Chocolate. Uh-huh. Cocoa. But it would be like cocoa. Cocoa. Because it's cocoa. the is it's la semilla, right? Yes. Cocoa. Yeah, that is the cocoa. Cocoa. Okay. Good. So thank you so much, guys. But yes, try to be prepared next time, okay? Because okay, uh, that sure. is the main purpose, okay? That you develop your ideas, um, that you speak. Okay. Uh, is missing group uh, two, team two? What is uh, Julio, Jose Andres, Katy? Lady and Lilian. Ready? Yes. You okay. can do it. Yes. Andres and Lady. Thank you, sir. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, our conversation is too short, teacher. I know that we have time to prepare, but uh, we don't have enough time. So I can make a new question, but I don't know if my group can answer the question. I don't know if it's, it's good or, or bad. <laughs> do it, do it. So we're going to see if they answer or not. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Uh <-huh. laughs> go ahead. So good night, welcome for our company. The name of this company is Moving Service. My name is Andres Martinez, and I am the boss of Human Resources. Here with me is Lady, my partner, and we are going to make you the interview. So, Lady, um, uh, go ahead. Hi, I am Lady Hernandez. Uh, I am part of Human Resource, this company. Thank you for being here. Nice to meet you. So, the first question. Please tell me, how do you describe yourself, Liliana, Katy, and Julio? Okay. Hello, good evening. My name is Liliana Polio. My myself I am responsible, team, helpful, collaborator person. Bien, dicen que no es del que corre ni del que quiere. Solo eso, después la otra. Hello, my name is Katy Hernandez. I am 30 years old. I am a person dedicated to work, responsible, and willing to learn and carry out activities in favor of the available vacancy. Uh, hi, Andres. Hi, lady. Nice to meet you. My name is Julio Paz and I appreciate the job opportunity. I consider that I share the same values of your company, uh, such as empathy, teamwork, responsibility, and honesty. And I am ready, I am ready to contribute to get the objective of the company of moving service. I consider that the satisfaction of the customer is the more important goal of the company. Thank you for sharing about you. I want to know, why would you like to work with us? Um, I am. Yes. Um, and I wish I call, I call the part of the company to be able to perform and demonstrate my abilities. Thank you, Liliana. And you, Katy? 
um, because it is a company with a long of experience, which has managed to position itself among the best moving companies. Thank you, Kathy. And you, Julio? I want to work in a good company because I feel identified with the vision and values of the company. I know that, that your company is committed to customer satisfaction. And that's, that is an aspect that I share uh, because I love to provide a good service. Uh, thank you for considering me as a potential member of your team. I look forward to the possibility of contributing to the sources of your company. My pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. My pleasure. So I have another question for you in this interview. For the another question is, what is the position that you want to apply in this company? And lady, um, Liliana, Kat, and Julio, we have a different position in this company. For example, administrative position, drivers, and the people don't have to translate the things. So um, I don't know what of this position do you want to apply? I am No sé si me escucharon, sí, no. Hay un recesionismo. Okay. Yeah, of course we have a, a position able for recessionists. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you. Um, thank you, Andres. Um, I want to apply to to a, a driver of a truck of transportation of a, for to transport the uh, no say of the goods. Okay. Okay, that's good. And Kathy. Okay, thank you. Kathy, what about you? What is the position that you want to apply? Mm, accountant. Account? Account. Okay. Yes. Okay, okay. The another question for you is, what are your salary requirements? And Liliana? Kathy and Julio. How many do you want to earn in the in your how, payment? How much money do oh, you okay. want? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I want to get a um, salary according to uh, my um, office. I want to get a uh, twenty-two dollars per hour. Okay, I take note. Mm -hmm. For the rest, what, what is your salary, salary expectation? Um, seven hundred dollars. Yes. Okay. Liliana? What about you? Aha, Liliana. Six hundred dollars. Six hundred dollars. Okay. Okay. That's great. So, lady, do you have another question that we can make for the interviewers? No, I don't. Okay, I'm going to make the last question for you. Uh, so, 
are you ready for work in in a long schedule? How because many hours? Have a, yeah. How many hours, Jose? We have a motto, uh, motto in this company, motto. Teacher is like a, um, dicho. Okay. Okay, we have a motto in this company that we have to work 24 hours for the seven, 24 hours a day to seven days a week. So I don't know if you are ready for a start right now. If you are able for a start right now in this company working. Thank you for the question, Andres. Um, I'm ready for work uh, extra hours. That is an um, um, opportunity to get uh, more money to send uh, to my family in El Salvador. Thank you. Okay, excellent. So you said that you work 24 hours, 24 seven. And Jose Andres, yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> we have to be 24 hours. 24 hours, yeah. 24 seven. <laughs> okay. <but> <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so it's you have like the model, opportunity. <laughs> yeah, you have the opportunity to work extra hours and you and, and get um overpay. Uh, um, that is overtime, right? When you I work wish. overtime, you earn a double the extra hours, right? When at which time you are to rest? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. They would be fine. <laughs> <laughs> like my it's like my job to. <laughs> okay yeah. very good so, guys yeah. very good job I don't know if you have more questions Jose Andres no no that's it teacher okay good job thank you so much good job lady okay Julio <clears throat> vision okay you yeah. mentioned that word vision 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 in your company right vision vision Mm -hmm. Vision. Yeah. Vision. Okay. That will be the correct pronunciation. And also you were talking about the position that you want to apply. That will be a, a truck driver, right? Truck driver. A truck driver. Mm -hmm. Okay. Carlos, yes? Uh, I have a question yeah, for, yeah. for Andres. Uh-huh. And the messenger company uh, has the polygraph policy. Yeah, yeah. You can uh, make a uh, make. A, yeah, you can call for the company and make the. How do you say? Um, what? Well, the cita, the date. Yes. You can make okay. the date. Appointment. Schedule, appointment, okay. Well, appointment, appointment. A so appointment. You can make the appoint appointment, yeah. You can call and make the appointment, yes. Okay, okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> Liliana, okay, we need to improve pronunciation, Liliana. Okay, in general. Can you hear me, Liliana? Can you hear me? Liliana. I'm sorry. ¿Qué me dijo? Mira, te digo algo. Vos yes. Tenés... We need to improve oh, pronunciation, ¿ok? Necesita eh, mejorar mucho pronunciación. Ah, try, sí. try to practice, ¿ok? Practice. Um, receptionist. That is the correct. That is that will be the correct word of reception. Receptionist. Perception. Yes. Uh, lady, we, when we said human resource, uh, human resources, okay? Human resources. Human resources. Human resources. Okay. Okay. Then every, uh, that was good. <clears throat> Everybody did a good job. Thank you so much. Okay. Good job, all of you. Thank you for your participation, okay? We have some minutes still to do some activities. Okay, there is a profile uh, form in the material. That will be a homework, okay? Try to complete the form. 
individual, okay? Try to, yes, um, right here. For example, what kind of job would you like would you like to apply? Okay. Or we have two options here. We have the job title, work location, department. Production manager, for example. Okay, that would be an example. Okay, report to full time, part time, full time. So if you want full time or you want part time, okay, try to complete that. Essential duties and responsibilities. Well, what do you consider that will be the duties and responsibilities in that position, okay? Education and work experience requirements, okay? Try to complete that. Employee name, okay? Employee signature. Okay, try to complete the chart because we're going to use it tomorrow for an, a different activity. Okay, we have it ready for yeah. tomorrow. Teacher, okay. Yes. This material is in the in the platform. It is, and already uh, I Chart. remember that I sent it to you. Do you okay. remember that I sent it to you last? Uh, yes, teacher. Via yeah, WhatsApp. Yeah, it is there in the okay. in the in the chat. If you look for it, there you will have it. That it is in page. 31. Unit 3, page 31. Okay. okay. I look for. Okay. Okay. Here we have different uh, human resources positions. Okay. It is just to practice vocabulary. We're going to match the positions in part two the one that we can see here, okay? We have recruiting coordinator, benefits specialist, HR generalist, administrative assistance, compensation specialist, talent management consultant. Okay, for these positions, for these six positions, we have one uh, definition. So we're going to try to match the correct position with a definition, okay? Number one, it says oversees both the talent review and performance management processes. Which position do you consider that will be for number one? Talent management consultant, consultant. Consultant, okay. Talent management consultant, okay. That will be number one. Okay, number two, <clears throat> develops appropriate strategies for clients regarding employee relation, disciplinary action, and operation operations. Do you hear generally? HR generalist? Yes. Okay. Okay, good. Works in a company in a company's human resource or personal department? HR generalist or recru recruiting, recruiting coordinator? Recruiting coordinator. Mm -hmm. Okay, recruiting coordinator mm -hmm. could be. Okay, is responsible for assisting with the administration of all benefits? Administration. Administration. Yeah, administrative assistance, okay. <clears throat> Handles administrative requests and queries from seniors managers. <clears throat> I think that is administrative <laughs> system. And the last is the other one number four is a benefit specialist number four is benefit specialist okay specialist. Mm -hmm. yeah so could be because he's talking about benefits <clears throat> okay designs and and implements overall recruiting strategy
benefit specialist. Benefit specialist. Okay. Well, I consider that some of them, the definitions that we have can be done for, uh, for example, administrative assistance can be both, uh, can be um, number four and number five, right? They are, they are kind, of, kind of confused. But yeah, it can be done for administrative assistance, number four and number five. <clears throat> and design and implement several recruiting strategy is also recruiting coordinator, right? Okay, but we have an idea about the responsibilities or uh, the position definition of, of each um, position. So now uh, what I want that uh, you do is try to think about three, three sentences or three ideas about people in your company that work in human resources. What are their tasks and responsibilities? <clears throat> um, three sentences, okay? Especially for people um, that work in, that work in human resources, okay? I will send the link to you in order you can write there the ideas that you have. <clears throat> Let me send it to you. Teacher, o sea que tenemos que enviar esas tres partes eh, escrito ahí? Yes. Mm -hmm. Three sentences. Okay. Write sentences about people that work in human resources in your company. Okay. Using the examples that we have in part two. Not the same uh, ideas, different ideas that you may have. There you have the link in Zoom and let me send it by WhatsApp too. Oh, let me take that attendance because yesterday I didn't take it. <clears throat> And then I, I take it with the list. I remember the ones that are then the class. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, Carlos Ernesto. Okay, thank you. Cindy Annette. Present teacher. Okay, Daniela Lisset. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Gilberto. Present teacher. Juliana. Hazel. Hazel. Okay, Hazel pidió permiso, right? Uh, Jose Andres. Present teacher. Julio Aristides. I'm here. Carla Idari. Carla. Carla iba a estar en el, en el hospital con su hermano, teacher. Ah, okay. Ah, Katy Briseida. Present teacher. Lady. Present teacher. Liliana. Present teacher. María Leticia. Present teacher. Mauricio. Present teacher. Robert. Present teacher. Salvador. Present teacher. Silvia. Present teacher, present. Okay, Wilbur Francisco. Present teacher. And William Boyce. Present teacher. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, I can see that uh, el, el orden de la lista ha sido updated. Okay, 
accordingly, accordingly um, to the order. Bueno, creo que no lo habían hecho y si me lo ordenaron el, de acuerdo a la lista, de acuerdo a su primer nombre, de la, alfabe, la primera letra. Ok, <clears throat> good. Thank you so much, guys. Teacher. For your attendance, yes. Um, the homework is about the responsibilities of human resources department at my company. Mm, do you mean this activity that you that you are writing now, or the ones that you are going to complete in the chart? Okay. Which one? Qual? Uh, I I talk about about the link you send at the WhatsApp. Oh, um, yes, it is about the ideas that you consider. Okay, that. Uh, people who work in human resources do in the company? What are the duties and responsibilities that they have? For example, okay. then the LSS uh, help to keep uh -huh, help to keep track of the company staff, help to solve doubts, handle the payroll. They have regulations that we must comply with. Okay. Okay, I get it, teacher. Okay. Carlos says recruit recruit candidates, hire the right employees, process payroll, conduct disciplinary action, update policies, maintain employee re records, conduct benefits analysis. Okay, be careful with a spelling of man maintained. Carlos, double check it. Okay, teacher. Uh, I try to the uh, correct it. Update it mm -hmm. um, or, um, or correct, correct it. <clears throat> and my my team, really? Oh, or which or which which were yes. Uh, that one. Oh. My nineteen. I don't know to share what's what missing uh, letter or or I don't know. It is missing one letter. Maintain. Mm -hmm. My ah letter N. Okay. Yeah. Maintain. Okay. Maintain. Maintain. Mm -hmm. Maintain. Oh, okay, teacher. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Good job. Teacher, ¿eso, ¿esto es para this moment? Or... Yes, this moment. Tomorrow. Ay, no logro entrar. But if you don't complete it at this moment, you will have two, two homework. Complete the chart and do this one, okay? If you have problems to get in, please let me know. Try to um try to use capital letters if that is needed. Okay, si es necesario utilizar uh, capital letters, okay, uh, letra mayúscula al inicio, please do it. Porque todo eso es necesario que ustedes vayan aprendiendo, ¿ok? How to use punctuation, correct spelling, uh, correct capitalization, cuando utilizar capital letters, ¿ok? Um, punto final? Final period. Final period. And comma? Comma. Comma. Mm -hmm. Ok, thank you. Punto y coma. Semicolon. Ah, semicolon. <clears throat> okay, dos puntos. 
colon. Colon. Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher, when I see it in, in English. I'm sorry. In the alphabet. Why not exceed any in English in the alphabet? Oh, because that is for just a Spanish. Remember oh, that really? each, yeah, each uh, language okay. has uh, like their Exclusive own term. alphabets or, or terms or uh, symbols. For example, yeah. French, we have a lot of symbols. Okay. Well, they have a lot of symbols that we don't have it in Spanish. We don't have it in English, right? Okay, <gasps> but the, the keyboard is especially in, mm -hmm. in should France. Be. Should be. Or or you can activate that online keyword. Oh, with okay. The, with all the characters needed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. I imagine with the... Chinese languages. <laughs> <laughs> well, they have they have like a three kind of letters. I like, um, mm -hmm. um, como tres uh, alfa alfabetos, algo así, a veces, uh, uh -huh. three really? kind of letters. Uh -huh. tres tipos de letras. One is like a basic, the other is like intermediate, and the and there is one that is advanced. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, uh, very interesting. Yes. Okay. Do you guys. like Chinese languages? Uh, or French? Or French? It is, it or is Germany language? It is complicated. I would like <laughs> to learn. Uh, yes, I would like to learn another is another languages. Okay. But, um, maybe the easier ones. Like uh, Portuguese, okay, Italian, um, French, Germany, Ger Germany, uh huh, French, but French is not, it's no easy. I have yes. tried, I have tried just in basic levels. <laughs> it's no easy. <laughs> yes, the the pronunciation really sound very difficult. It is. Uh -huh. Oui, oui. Yeah, it is difficult. Yes. Okay, guys, uh, we're going to do the activity 12 if you have, if you have time. Okay, uh, if you haven't completed the activity that we're doing at this moment, please try to do it for tomorrow, okay? Please open the, um, op open the homework. 12. Let me know when you are ready. <clears throat> Done, teacher. Done? It means that you you completed, right? Uh, no, no, I, I, yes, yes, I'm <laughs> I'm oh. ready. <laughs> no, que ya terminé. Excuse me. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Good, guys. Um, it is a little reading there. It is a short reading. Um, I guess you already read it or you haven't. Not yet. Okay, I will I will give you one minute to do it. Try to read it. Procedure to request training. Okay. What will be the first true step teacher. to provide? It is true or false? True, true, true teacher. False teacher. False, false teacher. Yeah, false. false. Okay, number two, true or false? You have to notify the talent management consultant about any trading you are interested in. True or false? True. It's true. That, that is true. Okay. Number three, <clears throat> is it 
not necessary to specify date, hours, or instructions in um, aid of the training in the notes for requesting participation in a training, true or false? False. 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 Human resources doesn't have anything to do with the process of enrolling in a training. True false. or false? Mm. False. False, right? Because mm. they do. And it's, it, it says doesn't. Uh -huh. You have to make sure all the information is clear and complete. True or false? Yes. True. 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 Okay. Be careful. Yes. Okay, there you have homework 12. Submit it, send it. Okay. Okay, guys, that will be everything for today. Thank you so much for your attendance. Um, see you tomorrow, okay? Enjoy the rest of the night, okay? Rest. Okay, teacher. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. 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 Good night.